Hi, everybody. How are you? Hi. How's it going? I turned on subscriber only mode. Um, you have to be a subscriber to participate in the live chat. So you'll need to subscribe and then you'll have to wait a few minutes. We are not going to put up with all the trolling and stuff that we had before. So I am sorry about that. So those of you that don't know me, my name is Lady Badger. I sell handbags and accessories. It's good to see everybody. How are you? Let me know if you can hear me okay. Let me move this down a little bit. I don't know. I got this light hanging on my phone and it's, yeah. Hello. You sure you got the chat thing right? <laughs> yeah. It's Roy Hi, Roy Hello. I'm all set. Do -do -do. So hopefully tonight, with all the new settings and everything going in, we will be... Hi, Karen. We will be troll free. Hi, Angela Forte. How are you? Polly in Paris. Good to see you. Deborah, are you staying crazy, girl? Are you staying crazy? Hi, Peggy. Henry, how are you? How are you doing? Excuse the hair. <laughs> the one of those days. But we're here to look at handbags, not what my hair looks like. Hi, Adriana. How are you? Rorlene, did you get my email? So, the, the straps that I got... I originally got them for personal use. So, right now, they are on sale at PortlandLeatherGoods.com. Um, you can get them for cheaper than what I would have to ask for them. 25% um, off. Hi, Cindy. So, run over there. Grab yourself some straps. There was a lot of interest in these. I did order two more. Uh, I know that quantities are getting low. So... I did two, order two more of the purse straps just in case a couple of you couldn't get any before they sell out. I did was able to score two more. But PortlandLeatherGoods.com is where these are. And I did get um, a couple of crossbody straps that would match some of my Portland Leather Goods um, stuff that I have. So, you know, I went on there and spent a good hot dollar. For some straps and, and, and things like that. Hi, Lisa. How are you? <laughs> oh, hey, that Robin. That was banned is unbanned now. Oh, so I had to get with Kristen D. And she talked me through the settings to keep the trolls out. Um, She talked me, you know, taught me a few other things. So, Linda Lobster. Um... Pauline Paris, you were on that list. Uh, Pauline, um, a few other people. Um, she uh, got banned, and I wasn't sure how to do that. So she talked me through all the safeguards and taught me through. So everybody that I recognize their names got unbanned. If you didn't, email me and let me know. But the settings now um, are as follows. To be able to participate in the live chat, you must subscribe and wait a few minutes. Um, yeah. So, the, I mean, that's how Kristen D. does it. And she told me that would help take care of some of that. We have other safeguards in place. Um, the stream is being watched. So, to make sure we don't have any more of that problem. Uh, it doesn't, it, it's, no, we're talking about the troll attack, the, we thought it was AI, but some of the things that people were saying were personal attacks, um, so they weren't AIs, so there's a full-scale investigation being launched, um, so, yeah, it, it's pretty bad, but we, sh it, that should stop, so, if you're with me, if you haven't subscribed, but you, you know, you buy and, and things like that. Um, if, if you're not seeing yourself subscribe, wait a few minutes. Um, then you'll be able to participate in the chat. 
um, I don't want to say um, where um, Google told me it originated from. It's best that I don't. Yeah, it's somebody we all know. So, yeah. Um, but, I mean, that, that seems to be the norm. There's, uh, there's quite a few YouTubers now that are getting attacked. And, you know, and it's looking like other YouTubers are doing it and what have you. And everybody is talking about it. The thing is, is I don't know if that's part of the scam. I would never go on to somebody else's channel and, and troll them and be nasty to that level. Uh, I, I, so I'm not sure what's happening or just people don't have anything better to do. Oh, you know, it's okay. Um, but as I'm watching some of the other YouTubers, um, they're, they're pretty much having some of the same problems. So I don't know. I, I, you know, it's an all out war. Apparently I'm not sure, but anyway, portnoleathergoods.com, 25% off. So the little strap was 33 on sale. The big strap, I think, was 47 on sale. So those of you who are interested, that's why I said go to portlandmothergoods.com because you can pick them up for those prices compared to what I would have to charge to send them and everything. You'll be paying more than that. You'll be paying like at retail. So why do that? <laughs> Nobody wants to pay retail. Oh, well, there you go. <sighs> So as per usual, I've chosen just a few bags um, to show you, and then I'm going to open up the floor. Um, I got one of those cool, I don't know if you can probably see it in my glasses. I broke my glasses. Jeremy had to run out and get me another pair. And I have one of these light things sitting on the top of the phone, and it's all up in my face. But it's pretty cool because Karen got me this really cool tripod thing, you know, and then I have... This little thing where I can do the thing when I get to Florida. Because I'm going to record all of that stuff. And I want to get... Yeah, I'm going to go... I want to record my first bins and my my total Vicky experience in Florida. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Jennifer, how are you? How's it going? Brian is circling. You're supposed to be in bed, young man. Go, go. We turned on cartoons for him and stuff like that, but he's circling the camera. He just loves the camera. So, if you want to come and say hi real quick, do not touch Grandma's computer. Daddy is moderating on that. Come and say hello, and then you, you got to go night-nights. Hello. Oh, say hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm a very big old man. Yeah, you're a big man. Are you a big man? <laughs> He's a big guy, you guys. Oh, look, you're getting hearts, Brian. Look, you're getting little hearts. Yeah. <laughs> I, want, I want to see blue hearts. <laughs> Robin's saying hi. Hi, Robin. <laughs> <gasps> Pixie said hi. Ann said hi. Hi, Pixie. There's Dawn and Roylene. Don't end worrying. Close. <laughs> oh. Is it funny? <laughs> There's Lori. Did you say Lori? Lori. <laughs> Cindy. Cindy. <laughs> Angela. Angela. <laughs> No, 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 no puppies up on the, on the couch. Okay. okay. All right, they're saying hi, baby. Hi. Say good night to everybody. You can go watch cartoons now. Pass out Grandma's bed, huh? <laughs> you watch cartoons? Oop, you have big faces? <laughs> Say hi, Elaine. Hi, Elaine. And Di Forte. Try Di Forte. What about him? That's Lori. You already said hi to Lori. There's Jane. Say hi. <laughs> okay. Time to go. Go seepy times. <laughs> yeah, sleepy times. My butt, right? <laughs> He's not going to go. It's not going to happen. He is a doll. Say hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Karen's on. 
and Deb. Right. Go watch TV. <laughs> now. I want to play here. I know you want to play on the camera, but that's not why they're here, sweetie. As beautiful as you are. <laughs> he wants to play on the camera. <laughs> TV now. I'll turn it off. Ooh, 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 don't make him cry. We're on live. Don't make the boy cry. Excuse me, I gotta put the baby to bed. No, honey, Grandma can't lay down with her right now. She'll come with you in a little bit. Okay. Sorry. Grandma's got to put him in bed. <laughs> he is very sweet. Yeah, I did. He's going to whine for a little bit, and he's going to make a ruckus. That's what he does. You know how it is with four-year-olds. Bedtime is fight time. Because now he's standing up with the remote in front of the television and he's doing this. So he's not in bed. He's... <laughs> she did, Don. I did, Don. You're my palatize. I'm excited. But speaking of boxes, I received this today. And I wanted to open it up with you guys. It is from Robin. And she sent it from Untie the Bow Gifts. My color of my hair. I have not dyed my hair in over a year. I'm trying to grow it out. Because every time I tried to blonde it, I don't know if it's menopause or what. We all know how that is. It's it's doing crazy things, turning crazy colors and doing crazy crazy thing. Yeah. Did you guys see? The amazing Portland leather tote that, came out of that Robin sent me. And for the prize. Here is the box. Sending love. Oh, good. Just dim the camera too. Fast. It says, You are so loved and so wonderful. Happy to call you my friend, Robin. Thanks, Robin. You're going to make me cry. Absolutely. You'll have that first thing in the morning if that's okay. These these um, tend to run extremely long. Friday nights tend to run pretty late. But I'll have it to you in the morning, Adriana. No problem. Oh, here he goes. <laughs> yeah. Well, they all know how a four-year-old is. He He's going to fight. He's going to cry. He's going to stomp his feet. Yeah. Poor baby. He doesn't want to go to bed. We've been trying to get him to go to bed for an hour. So he was sleeping, you know. Oh. So untie the bow. Oh my goodness. Hi, Marisol. How's it going? Ooh. So it looks like, oh, we have fuzzy socks. Woo. I'm going to put them on. Put them on. Ooh. We have, is that caramels? Caramels? You, you know, I probably won't even get to see one of those. You know, I had to check my work schedule because I think I'm off the 17th for the Palantines exchange, guys, but I'm not entirely sure. Ooh, peppermint tea. It's a beautiful gift. Robin. Oh, I'm cry. <laughs> Looks like there's a mug of some sort in here. 
How is everybody doing? Are we doing anything fun? Oh, it's kind of a beautiful mug. Good mug. Yeah, pretty. Very thoughtful. Please, live plants, please handle with love. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Get down here. Oh, the dogs. <laughs> I have to run upstairs into Jeremy's domain. <laughs> the puppy. You guys see it earlier? The puppy. I was trying, Brian and I were trying to record. Ooh. Brian and I were trying to record. And uh, I see this flash of brown. And I see this flash of pink. Oh, look here. Oop, got a little dirt on there. Yeah, beautiful, it's a little cacti. Cacti? Cactus? Hi, Vicky. Okay. Let's get those. Like a little spoon. I think that's for the tea. How pretty is that? It's like a gold tone. How pretty is that? Let's open it. How pretty. It's so soft. Ooh. Oh, it's a blankie. Ooh, and it's white. Brave. <laughs> Especially around here. <laughs> and wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. And it looks like a candle. Can't smell it. Hold on. Such a beautiful gift. Girl, you did not have to do this. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I don't know what kind. Doesn't say what the scent is, but I can tell you. It's beautiful. It's a hell of a Mmm. Mmm. It's nice and fresh. Okay, let me close this up. It's got the cacti from the dirt in it, and I want to make sure <clears throat> I get it all back in there so the cacti don't die. Wow. It is so soft. So, so thank you so much appreciate it it's a beautiful gift beautiful gift thank you thank you so much beautiful thank you Robin <laughs> very nice it's a beautiful thoughtful gift Jeremy's making fun of me Get them, ladies. See, isn't this nice? There is not a ton of trolleys. Ah. <laughs> I see, <Cindy. clears throat> All right, ladies. I probably chose maybe, like, I usually only choose like 10 to 12 bags, and then we just open up the floor. <laughs> so. Let's start with, where'd I put it? Hi, Marisol. Marisol's on, hi, Marisol. What's cracking lacking, girl? I have a beautiful. Hi, Dawn. <laughs> Love it, trolls. <laughs> well, they can't get in. Hmm. I'll subscribe for five minutes. Oh. <laughs> Robin is cloverleaf bags. That's Robin. Right above you. Hi, Robin. <laughs> you guys should check it out. She, I got, she was giving out Portland leather. I would have just spent my entire paycheck. Hello, Elaine. Hello, Let me are. show you guys what I got from her. And then I have, let me move the YSL here. So this is my newest acquisition from Portland Leather. 
I got a tote from Robin. I got my Karen charm, my favorite Karen Gentry charm on there. So this is beautiful. But I already, as a gift, you guys, she was giving out the Portland leather goods. I got a pencil case, and I've already got it just full of stuff. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Beautiful, beautiful bag. So they had their, they had a big sale. They're having, Portland Leather Goods is having a 25% off sale now for Valentine's Day, but. Oh. Everybody understands. They understand. They understand. So, but these, they had a 35 to 40% off sale, up to 70% off sale. So, I hit it, and I hit it hard, and I went ahead and, and I got two leather straps, one in this color, one in the chocolate, and two more ladies like this, um, just in case they sell out before you guys can get to it. Because if you get it off the site, it's 33 bucks on sale. Worth every penny, and it smells so nice. So... I appreciate you guys wanting to get them for me, but they'll be cheaper on the site right now. So that is the purse of the day. They are fantastic. I was only able to get one crossbody. Um, I'm hoping um, you guys are able to get it. I only got a couple of more of the straps. I got a lot of emails on the straps. And I told everybody, go to portandleathergoods.com. You can get them off. You know, 25% off right now. When I got mine, I hit it with a 40% off sale. So I hit it for the sale before this one. Um, so, yeah. But with cloverleaf bags, I mean, it is amazing. Let's see. She sent this brand new one, this Portland leather tote. Look at this. Good. Oh, look at that light. That light looks works really good up there. 75 bucks, y'all. Even with the sale right now, to get this, it's $135. So she sent it. She offered it. For 50% off the sale price, there was no way I was passing that up. No way, no way. And she was giving out free gifts. So, you guys, man, when she says she's having a sale, don't miss them. I chose one of these so that has the D-rings. So, that was part of the haul. Aren't they nice? I need more tuts I can eat whole in my head. But, you know. Girl cannot have too many tuts. I don't care what they say. Can't convince me otherwise. And you can't go wrong with Portland Leather Goods. And you can't go wrong with Dooney. And the, the purse Vicky sent me to clean up. Oh, it, it, it's, 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 uh, yeah, Denmark Heaven inside there. But I will, I will persevere. Oh. There we go. Yeah, we have a few that got in, huh? <laughs> Hi, Dolores. How are you? Yeah, I've seen that. Well, one is better than the other night. Remember, we got hit so fast. Woo. And she sent me this gorgeous. So there you go. Are you watching the trolls, Jeremy? Because they're coming in. He's on his phone. 
I just deleted two. That Sophia needs to go. Okay. Well. <laughs> There we go. You're going to get a few. But better than the other night. As Hadrian would say, your channel's not popping unless you get them. Yeah. So, without further ado, Bago Numero Uno, ladies. Well, hi, Mike. Good welcome, welcome. Um, I don't know why people troll. I, I, you know, maybe they don't have anything better to do. It's crusty Y. Some what? Who? Crusty Y. What's a crusty Y? Can you do a reaction to them? That's what the person's name is. No, get rid of them. I don't want to do a reaction to the trolls. I have better things to do. I don't know why people troll. They have nothing better to do. Okay. Woo, girl. I am I love doing tradesies. I do, I do. So I have first a beautiful Rebecca Minkoff. It's in like a it's in a chalk, like a like a purpley chalk, maybe. It's showing up through the color on his the camera here. But I don't want to make that thing any brighter, I won't be able to see. Earlier. Yeah. <clears throat> there we go. This is beautiful. There's the straps. Love the pebbled leather. Love the silhouettes. It's not too big, not too small. And is my tape measure in this vicinity? Sure. Have you seen it? I don't see it. I don't see it. You guys, look what I did in my glasses. Look at, I mean, for real, man. <laughs> it's very pretty. It does have, right here on the front, a little bitty mark right here. Now, I did use, show you what I use, another CPR on it. Um, it didn't remove that. I do have some of the stuff like Hadrian uses, but I'm kind of afraid to. But if you want me to, I will try. But I just don't want to blemish it. So it does have all its little tassels. And I do believe that was the only call out on this bag. We have a zipper closure. Here. Oh, we got something on the handle here. Oh, that could just be cleaned off there. I thought I got it all. This bag was, I'm not going to lie, scientific experiment hot mess when I got it. I got to get better at doing it the before and after. Read your comment? What comment, honey? I didn't see no comment. Read, read Beach Bracket's comment. It says, I'm so happy you're doing what you love. Keep it up. Oh, thank you. Welcome, sweetheart. Beautiful Rebecca Minkoff. Nice and clean on the inside. We got a zippy. Two slippies as usual. There's a little pocket where the Rebecca Minkoff is. A little. Maybe big enough maybe for your AirPods. And the strap. I have right inside here. So it does come with its crossbody strap. Uh oh. Matilda. Is snarly. Oh, Matilda being snarly. Okay. Dogs are fighting again lately, which scares me. So we have a beautiful, it's not small, but it's not big, guys. It's a medium size. Oh, I love it. Brick and mortar. Vicky and I are going to, we're probably going to, we're going to do one. I am actually, when I'm down there, I'm going to check it out. So. 
There may be a move for the Badger in the future. Get out of Illinois. You need to get out of Illinois. <laughs> uh, get rid of him. Yeah. All right. So if you like bag number one, the Rebecca Minkoff satchel, she is 55. She's beautiful. Already got it, Susie. <laughs> He is on it now. <laughs> I was waiting for a stupid comment. <laughs> that was one of them. Oh, thank you. Yeah, we we love our Robin. Come on in, Robin. The water's fine. <laughs> Absolutely. Did you put in number one, Jeremy? I was eluding people. Okay. Number one, Rebecca Minkoff Satchel, 55. I'm just a little guy. I've been around for a year. I just got like 700 subscribers. Um, I'm just a little guy. I'm no threat to anybody. Except me. I'm threatening him every day. Yeah. Right, what did you say, $50? 55. All right, number two. What did I do with it? It's in this vicinity. Oh, it was the beautiful leather, old school Calvin Klein tote. I showed this before. So I'm dropping the price $10. I'm offering this for $55. If it don't sell tonight, I'm just gonna keep it. It's beautiful soft leather. It's okay. She's probably doing her jewelry sale. She's in here with us or she's on live? She's on live. Yeah, she's got her jewelry sale. Isn't this beautiful? Please read my comments. You're so nice. You inspired my friend to do it in business. Oh, well, I'm sorry. I don't see the, I don't see the comment. I... It was a comment earlier. Oh, okay, I missed it. I'm sorry, Susie. We're all here to help each other. Any of these ladies in here, Susie, can answer questions and help out. They're Calvin Klein. Oh. Isn't this beautiful? Open pocket on the front. Love the leather. It reminds me of... Hobo International leather. Tad thicker, but the feel and the quality of it is about the same. Completely zip closure. Big chunky hardware. Calvin, C A L V I N. Oh, K L E I N. Dogs are over here messing around. Last time they were messing around, they, they tore the. They, uh, the electrical wires out of my donut, like, on a stick. Well, no. So that don't work no more. When they heard sounds, they jumped off the couch and ran into the wire. <laughs> so we have a big zippy pocket, two slips. There you go. There. Beautiful. This is beautiful. So this is on sale. We dropped it $10. The Calvin Klein tote is 55 tonight. Love the leather. There's the feet. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Love it. Put some fluff in it. Not, the tote's already full of fluff. Makes up half of the <laughs> Well, Vicky, Vicky, so Les, how are you? I have beautiful leather Calvin Klein tote, old school. It's beautiful. She's on sale tonight, ten dollars off. 
Gorgeous, gorgeous. It would be. Completely zips up. Hey, Marisol. <laughs> Excuse me. I have a messenger bag if anybody needs it. Brand new with tags. Yeah. Apparently, according to my sister, she's absolutely happy. She has another Boston Terrier brother named, was it Kevin, she said? <laughs> Calvin? Kevin? But she loves him, and they're having a good old time. And they are taking her for a second opinion on her problem with her legs and her ACL, um, her medical problems. So they're going to take her for a second opinion uh, to some university up north. Probably at Chicago. Yeah, because she acts like she doesn't have anything on her ACL. Yeah. The doctor appears. So she's happy. My sister assures me she's happy. And my sister wouldn't lie to me, even to spare my feelings, because that's just not the kind of sisters we are. <laughs> so she, yeah. she'd tell me. Now, when she says that, that's not a lie. That's a, that's a real thing. <laughs> they are like brothers, but they're in sister form. <laughs> okay. So this is one of these genuine leather. These India. So if anybody is looking for brand new with tags, it smells amazing. Beautiful messenger bag. Love the color. Super soft. Handles. So if you're in the market for a gorgeous messenger, look no further. I'm putting this on sale too. I'm dropping this $10 as well. I should ask $75 for it last time I showed it. It's been a while. It is $65 tonight. Scott. Snaps in the front. Beautiful. Then extra security. We got zippies. So you have a flap and zippy. You can just put a new tag leather messenger bag. It's the only messenger I got this evening. It has, there we go. Beautiful thick quilting for your laptops. There we go. We have open pocket there. Laptop area is nice and quilted. It is gorgeous. Big zippy on top of there. It is a great unisex bag. Male or female. It's gorgeous. It just smells. I could sit here and just. <sighs> Jeremy, get rid of the trolls. Unbelievable. The strap is a very long. I have it on the shoulder setting. There's only one. Just get rid of it. I got rid of it. Yeah. So on this longest part, this messenger bag will go all the way down to my almost above my knees. It is very long. It is a lovely, lovely bag. So you can shorten it to a, a purse, or you can sh make it really long, as long as you like. There you go. On the longest part, it goes down past my booty. <laughs> so that's number three. That's 65. Next is a beautiful Vince Camuto. In a real dark chocolate brown. 
looks like a raspberry kind of on camera, doesn't it? Hmm? It's Camuto. It's Camuto, yeah. C-A-M-U-T-O. Is that purple? No, it looks chocolate to me. Oh, it is kind of eggplant, isn't it? Well, over here it looks chocolate brown, but over here it's looking a little okay. more, a little more dragon's bloodish. <laughs> Hi, Mandy. How are you? Welcome. Welcome. So inside we have three areas. Dogs and children, dogs and children. Story of our lives. So this side has your open slips. This one has your open pocket and a zipper. And the inside is a really nice microfiber, real fine microfiber suede type inside. Got a middle zippy. Beautiful bag. Beautiful. So if you're interested in the Vince Camuto, it's number four. It is beautiful. She is 55. Here's her corners. Pristine. Beautiful bag. I love the detail of the strap. So she is 55. <laughs> what do I have next? Oh. Okay. Next I have, you guys have seen this, last time you seen this was in the tote sale. And I'm putting this on sale. I asked 55 for it at the tote sale. Tonight she's 45. Beautiful bright and tote. Leather. Brighten, yeah. It's a bottom. Mm -hmm. I try to take care of them. Don't get me wrong, sometimes some are sacrificed to El Ziggy Dog. We want to talk about that. <laughs> Big old pocket here in the back. Fuzz from uh, the paper is free. We all know this. <laughs> there we go. More paper. It's inside. You see down in there? The bright logo. See that? There we go. Ziggy dog. Ziggy. Stop, honey. Oh. Let's not rustle in the foyer. They're not listening. They're puppies. They're not going to listen either any more than Brian does. <laughs> Love the handles on this. <laughs> Beautiful. So she is on sale. 45. Jennifer called. Jennifer, you have a horse? It's a good deal, Jennifer. I do have something. Pretty special. This is a long chomp. Check it out right there. 
love the leather on it very soft it's got a bottom zippy with long chomp in there not too big not too small this leather will patina this leather will scratch it will do all kind of fun things and just look more beautiful in time looks worse than it is on camera but trust me it's not that bad it's not it looks yeah but to look at it in the normal light it doesn't look like that so if you like long chomp and you like leather now this is a smaller tote so it's extremely lightweight and beautiful it's the handles it's the bottom your back Isn't that beautiful So we all love our long chomp. Is that like a smaller or is it just a medium one? Um, they might consider it a medium. To me, it's a small tote. How about the other long chomp small tote? Yeah. The inside. So this is a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous tote. The Vince Camuto? Yeah. Where is... Ah! <laughs> I'm trying to find my... Brian likes to use things. Yeah, I'm going to need a tape measure. All right, he's going to get a tape measure for us. And I'll, I'll measure it for you. It should have been right there. Yeah, it should be right here. But it is not. How suspicious. <laughs> Me. Could you not? I didn't say it. Oh my god, don't cuss at the dog. What a grief. Excuse Jeremy's language. Dogs are fighting your country. <laughs> well, okay, but you can't be doing that. <laughs> well, oh, you guys got in trouble. Now they're over here. <laughs> over here hiding. Did you find the tape measure? Not in my office, no. Uh, I know where one's at, but it's not a small one. It's a big, goofy one. Well, you yours. need one. I can't give them measurements if I can't. Oh, I found it. Found it. Are you serious? Yeah. You Sit down, potty mouth. Yeah, okay. All right. <laughs> Sorry for my language, ladies. He won't do it again. <laughs> I might. You don't know it. All right. So it is 11 and a half tall. It is 13 wide. And it is about six deep. The Vince Camuto. That was number four. So the long chomp is number six. If you're interested in a long chomp, she is 65 today. For a leather long chomp, ladies. There you go. 65? 65. 65. John says okay. <laughs> For when I said sorry, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> but, bad, but still, you never know. <laughs> you have your subscription stuff. Oh, gotcha, Marge. <laughs> so let me check here March your Patricia Nash Oxblood was not picked up yet so I can ship them together so you don't have to do shipping Miss March no actually Dawn it is actually really light Really, really light. Yeah, it's really, really light. What's the little Dawn bag? 
She can't help herself, Don. She kind of pick on you, you know? Oh, she did. I saw that. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. <laughs> so, this is a little brand new with tags. The name of it is called the Metallic Sophia. Sophia. Top handle. Retail price $349. The Little Rose Gold Kate Spade. <laughs> it's a little dime bag. <laughs> Did you put in a long time, sweetie? Okay. So I will show you guys this one. Isn't this cute? I'll show you this one in a minute. I don't want to get out of order. So next thing. I tried this, guys. It is too small. So I am going to offer the little dreamer. The medium dreamer. And I give, and to be honest with you ladies, I give it. I thought this was bigger, so I don't know how much longer I'll be able to carry that before I grow grow out of it. This is a dreamer or coach? This is the coach dreamer. It's in a nice eggplant ox blood. And it is the most beautiful bag ever. I love the dreamers. Seven and a half tall. By 11 wide. And it is four deep. It is cute. So it has this little front here. And it has another little front here. And it's suede on the inside. I've got the arm straps inside the bag. So it does come. Or like crossbody strap. So it's the big one that has the arm straps. There we go. So it does have its strap. Go. You got your slips and zip. It's too big for you, Don. It's too big for you. It is not too big for Don. You you around when uh, Don got the roots bag? You would have fell over, Vicky. It was a big bag. She bought a badger size bag. <laughs> so she's you know. <laughs> She's moving up in the world. <laughs> That's funny. You know, you just can't, you can't go wrong with Roots. Yeah, she loves that respect. I got a Roots backpack. So it's a beautiful bag. <laughs> the bottom gorgeous so if you're interested in the medium-sized dreamer it's not as small as the black dreamer I have in there this is the next size up I like this silhouette better than the, the boxy one she is 125 if you are interested Oop, Marisol's calling it. Yep. You're going to love it, Marisol. And it smells so nice. It's a beautiful, beautiful bag. But I got my big dreamer. As I tried, and I tried to stuff so much in it, 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 it got it weighed a ton when I put all my stuff in there. Like the, the little uh, Portland leather I got back there. I'm trying to downsize. 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 Yeah. Carry smaller ones, but 
you guys. I can't do it. I can't. I have too many things I feel I must have next to me at all times. Clearly, it's not a hairbrush. But, you know, other thing. <laughs> so, when I moved into that one, I emptied the pouch. So, we have beautiful Patricia Nash pouch. I now have the Portland Love Eye. Beautiful tool. Love the caramel color. Yeah, I saw that on Discord. I'm glad you like it. I like the little uh, coach bag you had with it. This beautiful suede. There's the inside. Look at that. Even though I kept my pins and stuff in there. Look at that. Beautiful. You have to carry your iPad? Yeah. You have to know what I carry. <laughs> well, yeah. I'll show you guys. No big deal. It's sitting right behind me. So, this is a bigger pouch, guys. So this is one of the bigger ones. She is... Six and a half by nine wide. And I have her stuffed up pretty good. She's at a two stuffed up. She'll probably be a one, one and a half flat. So if you're interested in the Patricia Nash, I'm asking 45 for her. She's in pristine condition. Yeah. Okay. You guys are so funny. Here we go. So, she's already busting at the seams. She is busting. So, we have the Portland Leather Goods in there, and it's got ink pens, uh, some lip gloss, eyeliner, some medicine. Little packet of, you know, the Tylenol packet. <laughs> so, yeah. So that's in there. But it, I mean, it holds a ton. Wait till you see what I've got in there. Then I've got my coach pouch. And this week I'm carrying the Tom Fords. So they're in my little couch. Couch. My little coach. Oh. Did you get them? I have my checkbook is in here. And I have my big old Kenneth Cole Reaction Body Spray. Is in there. And my wallet. My inhaler. And a tube of Bath and Body Works, Aromatherapy, Lavender Vanilla Hand Cream. And my Chanel. Yeah. So it holds all of that. I couldn't get the Patricia Nash to fit in there, though. So it was just a little too tall. But this thing holds quite a bit. Yeah, a whole spray. Right down in there. So. But I work in a an environment that it can either be extremely cold or extremely hot. So, and I don't always have access to the locker room and that, so <coughs> I'll carry something. And I let other people use it too. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah. 
Anybody get this? This one? Portland leather. This is one I just picked up on their last sale. They had these on sale. So I was able to score this one, I do believe, for $99 with the sale. It was on the 40% off sale. Yeah. I love it. So, it weighs about 1,000 pounds now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, a Lotus Wallet, a B. Mikowski. Wow. Yeah, Crescent Moon. It is beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. There, now you have to see what was in my bag. <laughs> A fraction of what I usually carry is what's in that bag. So, the Patricia Nash pouch, like I said, number eight is 45. And the last one I picked before I open up the, the, the floor is this old school, believe it or not, this is a Michael Kors. Old school heavy leather. It's almost as thick as saddle leather, but I don't believe that's what it is. I think it's just big, heavy leather, and it's gorgeous. Yeah, it's got the buckle details. There's the bottom. Nope. Yeah, huh? Nope. Well, oh, it's just a handbag. It's got a magnetic snap closure. It holds the tongue. No, Sarah. Sarah, no. Get down. So you got your zip, your slips. Get so what do you guys think of that light up there? That works pretty well, doesn't it? It is a great color. It's a great color. Magnetic snap closure. I love how it's slouchy. Get down. They don't make them like this anymore. This is real thick, good leather. It's not... Um, it's not a heavy bag. What are you doing? No, 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 here. She's being insistent. Okay, doggy. Okay. Got the puppy. Insists on in. being right here. So we're going to move these bags so she's not on them. Okay, lay down. beautiful yeah i got it I don't, know, I don't know what to pay for that i put the grocery order in um got it at walmart it's one that clips on the top of your phone and i pay what 20 bucks for it works really good because i got the tripod karen gentry sent me so it works great so if you're interested in the vintage michael kors he's 55 Beautiful thick leather. It's a gorgeous bag. <laughs> Jennifer Yellow Horse, then? Okay. <laughs> so we'll make this number 10. Since Vicky wants to see the little. Dawn size bag. This is a beautiful rose gold Safiano leather Kate Spade. If you guys remember, I had two of these. Do you remember last year? This is the other one. I had it put up. So it opens up here in the front. Okay. It does come with a chain with a leather shoulder part. Here we go. Got a little slip. It's got another little slip on this side. I try. I try to be, you know, to be competitive and to be fair. You know, it, it's kind of a trade-off. I don't mind paying up for some of my bags if I get better quality. Um, I charge a little bit more. 
but you know, I, I take pride in my bags, and if there's something wrong that's not disclosed, I will take care of it. So, this is Kate Spade. Mm -hmm. This is the Kate Spade. I forget what it's called. What did I say? Sophia? Yeah, S A F F I A. The Metallic Rose Gold Sophia. I don't know if you guys can see that. There it is. I put rose gold leather case space. Yeah. yeah. So she's beautiful. I have had her now for what? Over a year and a half, guys? Yeah. But she is actually a rose gold. She's pretty. I'm going to clearance her. Are you guys ready? 65 clearance. $345 bag. No, oh, don't go in there messing with Brian. He's sleeping. You're not going outside because you bark at the store. Uh -oh. <laughs> so, she's gorgeous. If nobody's interested, she'll just go right back up on my shelf. Clearance her at 65. Cute little bag. Cute, cute, cute. Cute, cute, cute. Yeah, Safiano. It sure is. It's beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> Next, guys, I have. I sold the blue one, guys. I do have the other one. I still have the taupe. The Bacchier, brand spanking new, $268 retail, zipper detail, this is a tote, B-O-T-K-I-E-R, Bacchier, I never unwrapped the Bacchier logo, it is beautiful, love the zipper details. Brand new with tags. It's been on the shelf. I figure it's time to pull her down. So, I would say she's a medium tote. So, to me, this would be a medium. Yeah, it's beautiful. Wait till you guys see the inside, though. You should see this mountain of purse stuff they have. Ridiculous. So, she does come with a crossbody. She does come with her dust bag. Here we go. Nice silver metallic on the inside. Beautiful bag. Subtle. You're not going outside. <laughs> Maybe he's got to go potty. You ever think of that? Beautiful. Love the pebbled leather. It must go bark at things. Uh, no, we can't be doing that. And make sure I got everything. The strap here it is okay so if you are interested in measurements or you're interested in the baki bag yeah i'm gonna let him go you ready 65 brand new 298 dollar retail beautiful Right before evangelism. Uh oh. Yeah, it looks like Jennifer Beach is there. <laughs> yeah, she had mine on the uh, inner space waiting for it. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, girl. You're going to love, love, love this. Love, lovey, lovey, lovey. I also have something cute and fun, if you guys love Marc Jacobs as much as I do. I tried using it. Eh. Mm. So he's new. So I have this little, cute little Marc Jacobs card holder. Paid a premium price for this thing, but I'm not using it. 
It's got a little tag thing down there. A little tag. So we need a Mark Jacobs fan. Love the pink polka dots. I got you. There you go. These things are ridiculously expensive. Somebody explain to me why this is ridiculously expensive. Is it because it's the new Marc Jacobs or because it's pink and pokey dotted? I'm not sure. They're going for upper of hundreds or dollars, hundred and some dollars, and then on Poshmark and all that. I don't know. If anybody is interested in the Marc Jacobs, I'm going to... I'm only going to charge $55 for mine because she needs a home. Brand new. The Kate Spade, too. Oh, because it's a snapshot? It's not white. The back here isn't white, honey. It was taupe. Oh, well. I'm not I'm sure. I'm not sure what I missed. Oh, okay. Because it's a snapshot. Well. <laughs> okay. Okay, then. What does Elaine make? Is it because I missed white? Not dope? Yeah, Elaine, honey, what am I missing? Yeah. Well, mine's only 55. So there you go. Beautiful. I'm not going to use it. It'll sit up there for the gates bay. <laughs> Just kind of sit up there and look good on the in the studio. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're interested in that, just holler. So now what I'm going to do is scare the dog. I'm going to open up the floor. Expensive little things. I, I, what did I give Hadrian for this, you guys? Probably just under a hundred bucks, around a hundred bucks, or whatever. But I think I used it for maybe one day. It just, I will lose it. So if I'm digging for it, digging, 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 trying to find it, trying to find it, trying to find it, I'm gonna lose it. So I got that little. The smallest wallet that I've ever owned in the in the Marc Jacobs. It only you know hold it only holds like one or two credit cards, and it might only hold maybe a dollar or so. And that's working out better because it's bigger and chunkier. Anybody understand what I'm talking about? Like, I will set this down and forget about it, or it'll fall out of my pocket or whatever. These are dangerous for me. I need something. I'm a dork. You know what? <laughs> one of those things. So, did you put the Mark Jacobs snapshot in there? Mark Jacobs pink with white dots. Oh, you did? Okay. I put pink with white dots card holder because Oh, pink with white dots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had that already written down yeah. before you said snapshot. Yeah. So, I am ready now to open up the floor. I showed you... Kind of what I pulled and what I wanted to show you. Give you a few deals. So don't be afraid to ask for something. I am really trying to downsize. So if there is something you're truly wanting to see, let me know. It's open floor time. I said that. Oh. <laughs> it's my own name on there. <laughs> Yeah. So, like, with even with mine, I've got the... So, Marisol is in here. Girl, look at this. I pulled this out because I put it in the in the purse room in my, um, uh, in my desk there. And I couldn't... These are the ones I was asking about. I was completely and totally freaking out because I couldn't find... My Dawn glass, or no, my uh, Marisol glasses. I'm sorry, Dawn. 
and I was freaking out. And I found them. You guys, I want to show them to you. Take other glasses off first. So. Well, duh, Jeremy. <laughs> and the reason why I got these is because they have the nose pieces and all that. You guys, look, look, look at these. Ooh, they dark too. I can't see nothing. <laughs> Aren't these lovely? Beautiful Pradas. Love it. I'm so stoked. So it's probably time for me to retire the Mar um, our Tom Fords. Those will go into a drawer. <laughs> Aren't these gorgeous? Love them. You guys need to check out Marisol's Poshmark. Is this where I got them? Yeah. They are sassy and cute. I got it from Marisol. So check out her Poshmark. You guys, I really want to list on Poshmark and stuff like that. But, I, you know, I think what's happening is I read too much Discord and too much stuff these people have to say in their lives. I'm not real thrilled with a lot of sellers on Poshmark that do the live shows. I think some of them are absolutely shady. Um, present company excluded, of course. But, I mean... She said they keep them shut up. Ah! <laughs> hey, man. When, you know, when you're, you're going to... Hey... You know, my favorite thing in the world to do is to source from my friends. Look at this. These aren't going anywhere, man. These aren't. <laughs> Mine. But. Yeah. Marisol, I can make you a moderator if you want. You can put a link in there. Is she in here? I'm going to add you as a moderator. There you go. And now you put your link to your Poshmark channel in the chat. We got 67 people in here. Mm, not a whole lot in the grand scheme of things, but we'd love to have you all anyway. So now add your stuff. There you go. Woohoo! Put your link in the chat, girl. You guys, look at the quality. Look at, look. Holy moly. I'm loving these. I still drive with the Givenchy's I got from Hadrian. <clears throat> I still drive with those because they're plastic and lightweight. And I wanted to pull these out and trade them out. And, and I, for the life of me, they weren't with the rest of the stuff. And I almost had a stroke. So I'm just finding them. So, I'm really, really stoked. Hmm? Yay! <gasps> What's 12.15 Eastern? Is that 1.15... Eastern Standard. For me? Marisol, I am off tomorrow. I can actually come to one of your lives. Oh. Is that 115? I'll have to look that up. 1215 Eastern. Eastern Standard Time. Your girls are really cool about posting a link to it um, in the Discord. For some reason, I tried unblocking everything from Poshmark. It'll be at 1115 for us. 1115 for. Ooh. You're welcome. You're welcome. I will be there with bells on, man. Hmm? Yeah, so Easter Standard's an hour ahead of us. Okay, she's an hour ahead of us. Okay. What do you guys want to see? Throw it out there. And don't tell me the, the, the poor Mark Jacob snapshot handbag that my dog ate. I'm still really mad about that. I did find one, Marisol. I found one to replace it on Poshmark, but I don't know this Poshmark person. Hmm. Hmm. 
And I don't know if it's the same one. I want the same one. Oh, it's not working? Oh, I'm sorry. All right, throw some stuff out at me. Yeah, DeForte says 11.15, Colleen 10.15. Well, if she's going on at 11.15, Valerie, um, there you go. <laughs> A small coach birthday purse? Oh, I, I have a, I have a Dooney birthday, Dooney. Um, no. Oh, the birthday bag is the large, it's my large bag. It looks just like the other one, <laughs> the Dreamer. I have the large Dreamer in Oxblood with the studs. That is the birthday bag. Our different specific, I love how Polly put specific STD. <laughs> Do you have a specific STD? Oh! Pacific, oh, oh. Standard. <laughs> sorry, Pauline, I'm sorry. <laughs> the vintage coach, I haven't found yet. I have a few people um, asking for it. The only one that I can find right now is that blue one that I've got from those big YouTubers that are always on whatnot, um, Harry Tornado, or whatever. Um, it's tore up from the floor up, man. It's a really weird name. Yeah, it's... Harry Tornado. <laughs> yeah, Harry Tornado? Harry Tomato. Harry Tornado. Either way, it's a weird name. Harry something. He's Harry. So. Do you have a small dreamer? I do, Roylene. I have the black one. It's black. And it's more of a square... Um, Marisol bought the Dreamer, uh, the, the, the mini version of my birthday bag, but I do have, I do have another Dreamer in black. It's smaller. If you'd like to see it, Roy Lane, I'd be more than glad to give it to you. It is, it's brand new. It's too small. I can't, I can't carry that. Harry Tornado. <laughs> Not fuzzy, Harry Tomato. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I was going to ask you about that, Marisol. You may, Roy Lane. You can see whatever you would like. This is open floor time. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, I think I just moved everybody. I just moved everybody. I'm sorry. Let's find out. I got out my britches. Didn't come with me. Nope, you're fine. I have Mark Jacobs collection, uh, Alexander Wang, uh, let's see, so they're saying duty and bark and bucket bags. Either one, I think it's just bucket bags in general. Oh, I can't. 
They have to say crossbodies. Everyone's saying Sarah's cute because she slurred his butt. <laughs> huh? Everyone's saying Sarah's cute because she slurred his butt. Hold on, I'm coming, I can't. I can't hear you, love. I dare you. I can't hear you. Everyone's saying Sarah's cute because she slurred his seat. Oh, she th she's on my seat. <laughs> okay, so. Drop body. So if you got bucket bags, doonies, and the bag you were going to show, you're a small dreamer. That's pretty okay. much it. That one and the pink one, those are my new ones. I have, I can let one of them go. Okay. Elaine saying Florentine Dooney. that is so I do have the two new buckets and I put one of my straps on it but I can let one of them go I got a beautiful baby pink and then I've got the dark red oh, let's see the dreamer Florentine though oh I dropped it wipe out Sorry. Um, the Florentines. Now, I do have the satchels, but they're pebbled. The Florentines that I have, they're the big Smiths, guys, are the Florentines. And I do have one Florentine left um, in the closet, I do believe. But it is, it's not a satchel. It's just a bag. I do have the red Smith that's brand new, the Florentine, and I do have another brown one that the dog didn't eat, so I do have two. <laughs> the dog didn't chew the corner a little bit. I have the J.W. Anderson that I got from Hadrian. Amanda says bring them all. Bring them all.
if somebody had got the red Florentine. Okay. You're going to get rid of that one? Uh, most of them have to go. So, I'm happy with keeping one of the Smiths. I'll talk about the Dooney. Yeah, I've got my, my birthday Dooney. I've got the other satchel. I'll show them if they want to see it. It's really small. This is the Dreamer. It's the flap style. It has got the suede in the front, the black suede, the maroon suede inside, pebbled leather, and then some more suede. Your coach tags. Is she still here? She wanted to see the dreamer. Is Roylene still here? Yeah, I think she's just like. Oh, Roylene! This is a this is a wow bag. It's pebbled leather. Pebbled leather, suede, smooth leather. This you get everything. There's one side. There's your Creed. Then I have. The crossbody strap is inside. I'll show you the other side here. It's your coach tab in there. This is a substantial little little bag. So, I do believe the way it was stored, it got a little warm, so I need to smooth that back down a little bit. It's never been used. So, for this little Dreamer, I will do it at the same price as the other Dreamer. I would do $125. She needs a home. She's been sitting on my shelf for over a year. So, I would say this is medium. It's not real small, but it's not real big. So, you want some measurements? Sitting on your hands? <laughs> Grab it now. Good luck trying to find one at that price. It is seven tall by ten wide. And about three and a half deep. How much for pink duty and flower strap? And my strappy poo? Well, she was asking for how much the pink bucket duty is with the flower strap. That's, oh, the pink one. Look at that. That's brand new. I think I got these on the... Got these off the website. So, these I got off the website. I got them when they had their sale. So, I mean, if you want one of these... Linda's one. Huh? Linda's one. Hi, Linda. Can you get in? You got in! <laughs> hey, how are ya? So, this bag will be 165 It's brand new. Just bottom off the site. That's about... Yeah. So, these are bought off the site. I didn't... Yeah. You want to see inside it? And at 165, I'll throw in the strap. It's okay. I got another one somewhere. Yeah. 
brand new. I haven't even used it yet. I haven't even bothered. It's a bigger bucket, guys. This is the big one. They charge a lot of money for these on the website. So. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. You want the strap? And the small dreamer? Okay. And put all this bits and bobs back in there. Isn't that cute? I haven't been able to find any more of those straps. Let me write that down or I forget and then Roy gonna be mad at me. So should email me tonight or tomorrow, sweetie. No worries. No worries, Roy Lane. I gotcha. I'm gonna take out a little paper here so I can put strap down in there because if I don't it's not going to show up and then you're going to be all upset at me. <laughs> Congratulations Roiling. Those are yours. Okay so Florentines right or crossbodies. I have the poppy crossbody. I still have that guys. This was one of the ones that uh One of the ones that was a badger rehab, and it comes with a little pouch. So I still have that. White or is it just a color? Yeah, just Coach Poppy crossbody. Stripies. Then I have the white crossbody. It's more like a chalk. I do believe this is vintage. It's one of the pop blocky things. <laughs> There you go. There's your hang tag. It is raw leather on the inside. There's your creed. Let's pull it out. This was made in the USA. So it looks like it's L as in Larry 6 0 Made of cowhide in the United States. Uh, yeah, it's vintage. And it's one of those. <laughs> so it has... The bag itself is a chalk. And it's very nice. Now the strap, on the other hand, is very nice. But see, it's discoloring. So it is adjustable, but it is not removable. Um, it needs probably a refresh on the strap. I can try to do that for you and give it a refresh. Um, I would need a week or two to do it. Uh, White raw interior. What? Raw leather interior. As well. It is absolutely vintage. So if you're interested in... The white vintage crossbody with the snappy like I, I forget what these are called. <laughs> snappy lock. I'll let her go for sixty-five. Beautiful bag. What about the poppy coach? And if you're interested in the the poppy set, this is a set. This is forty-five. Cute little. There you go. 
That light is cool. Yeah, yeah, it was the best 20 bucks I ever spent. <laughs> yeah, it was like, go to Walmart.com and yeah, check out. I checked out ring lights at first, and then I just kept scrolling, and I found it. It just looks like a square. It's got the little LED lights in it, and it sits right on top of your phone. Huh? <laughs> yeah. So I have those two available. I did pull this because I'm not going to wear it. I do have the pink Marc Jacobs. It can be a crossbody or a shoulder. I bought this from Hadrian think, not thinking that I could use it in the spring. But I'm having issues with bags even twice the size. So I know I'm not going to use it. That's a Marc Jacobs. So I'll offer it up for what I paid him. So, so if you're interested in the Marc Jacobs crossbody, 65 That's all I paid him. <laughs> so... What else? Here, here. I hate <laughs> oh. <laughs> now here's a bucket bag to beat all bucket bags. This don't sell. That's fine. <laughs> we got the crisscross. Bucket tote. From you know who. The old school one. Beautiful. This is the Mark Jacobs crisscross bucket. It is. It is. It's like an a. Uh, it's like an a taupey, like a, like a greeny, beigey, so grayish, cross greeny. C R I S. What if I can pull? Aha! Yes, this is a Mark Jacobs. This is an older Mark Jacobs. That's December and January, Kelly. Yeah, it's um. It is true to color. It's like a greeny grayish. I want to say grayish. Topi grayish. That is unique, isn't it? This is beautiful. These are insanely expensive. So I've held on to it. But it's a bigger, it's a bigger bucket. It is our beloved Marc Jacobs. I love Marc Jacobs. That's no secret. I love it. I love it with all my heart. Yeah. But I'm a fan of the, the Marc Jacobs collection. Which I do have a bigger quilted Mark Jacobs collection piece that I am considering that I've been hoarding. <laughs> Isn't this cool? So the crisscross Mark Jacobs. If you're interested in this one, yeah, grayish. <laughs> so if you're interested in this one, this is one forty-five. Mm hmm Perfect. That's perfect. That's perfect. That's perfect. Yeah. Grige. 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 I love it. Yeah, this is a badger bag. This is out of my own personal stashola. Yeah. Beautiful. So, the pink one sold. <laughs> right lane. <laughs> yes. You said it. I did say it. I did say it. Oh, hey. I'm gonna get killed from here. All right. 
Choose the beauty. I'm going to go around here so I don't kill myself. <sighs> I'm going to... Okay. My light? No, I had it down low. Okay. Well, it's the battery thing there, so it's going down. Oh. I do have one. Mark Jacobs collection quilted. I do. I have a lot of Mark Jacobs collection. I have a lot of Philip Lim. Isn't she nice? She's the medium size. She's a bigger one. Because yeah, you guys know, you know me. Bigger. So it has the three compartments. Has a little bit down there in the corner. A little bit of discoloration. Let me try this. See if I can pull it out. Huh? Well, heavy. No. Not heavy at all. The chain is significant. But no. There we go. Can we get closer? Right there in the corner. It's a little brown. It looks horrible in camera, but that's not, not bad at all. I can try again. I bought it like that because I, I didn't care. There you go. It's got the zipper middle. Beautiful. So, this is a beautiful, beautiful day. Love it. I could show you guys Mark Jacobs' collection all day. And just be tickle pink. I love it. I like the older school, you know. Yeah, some people say it's grandma-ish, but you know what? I'm a grandma, so suck it. I like it. <laughs> it's like she has not brought up the good stuff lately. What? Oh, I <laughs> she has to see the quilt. Yeah, but Karen's saying right and she has not brought up the good stuff. Karen, Karen good you're rotten. <laughs> what do you mean this isn't the good stuff? In the Mark Jacobs collection. What are you talking about? Is like the good stuff? This is the good stuff. I got bigger stuff. Thank you so much for sharing, sweetheart. No, oh, you're welcome. Good stuff. What are you talking about? Are you talking about like the Fendi? You guys have seen the Chanel a thousand times. The Fendi. Uh, Linda, and then. Linda wants to know the price for it. On what? The one in your hand. This? <laughs> what did that girl say? I don't want to sell my bag, so it's four million four hundred forty thousand four hundred. <laughs> um. Hmm. You know, I haven't, I haven't thought about it actually, but I think I would let it go for one twenty-five. That seems to be the the going rate. purses have been hanging around in my house for years. Karen's like, no, this thing ain't a lot behind the seats. <gasps> what are you saying? <laughs> That's an understatement. Okay. Yeah. Well, if I could show you guys, I would. All right. So I have stuff in my living room, even like my pretties. The beautiful stand bag that I got from We Know Who, beautiful woman. It's up there. And I'm not showing you. It's not for sale. <laughs> I do have the silver Alexander hey, Wayne weapon bag I got from Hadrian hanging here. Hey, get the bag lady Jordan. Hey! Hi, Jamie! She's saying what kind of bag is that? This is a Marc Jacobs collection quilted flat bag. <laughs> so that's what that is. So. And then somebody asked to see my Florentine. <sighs> She's saying so tempting. And then. <sighs> oh. 
Karen, this is Mark Jacob and Mark Core. Michael Kors collection bag. The tote? No, she was saying what the bag was that was in her hand. Oh no. There's this No, that's not Michael Kors, honey. Mark Jacobs collection. This is Mark Jacobs. I do have a Michael Kors collection bag, but it's a tote. It's a great big massive Tote. Yeah, Mark Jacobs. I do have more Mark Jacobs. Uh oh. Polly. <gasps> <laughs> okay. So, what do we do when beautiful, beautiful babies leave? We kiss them goodbye. <laughs> Let me write that down. Let me write it down. Let me turn the page over. Yeah. Well, I mean that's a that's a good price. This is a this is a bigger flap one. So she's getting an amazing deal. Following Paris. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's beautiful. You've got Royal Aim. Got the good ones. So here is my last Florentine outside of my Smith bags, guys. The brand new attacks. I do have a purse that looks similar to this in the other room, the new one. Um, kind of a similar silhouette, but that is a, um, oh, that is a Dooney, isn't it? Yeah, mine is Dooney. That's a Dooney? The patchwork Dooney? Oh, are you talking about the stripe one? I have one Fendi left. One. But I paid a better part of $1,000 for that Fendi. So I don't know if I'd be able to give a good price on that one that you guys would, you would want that for. Yes. Actually, Pauline, I um, went over the inside. You remember the inside of that bag was... Um, I went over it again today. Hello. Gave it another um, once over. That bag, I'm telling you, that, that, that coach bag, girl, gave me a run for my money. So this is the Florentine new attacks. So I do believe you can still get find this one on their website. This is the medium sack with the twisted strap. You can get it on a Dooney website for three hundred and ninety eight dollars. <laughs> I didn't pay that. No, oh. I have the beat. There's a lady on YouTube selling a patchwork Dooney like yours for three fifty. Yeah, they're not they're not cheap. For what? Oh, this one. It's two twenty five. If anybody's interested in this one, it's a hundred bucks off the website. Um, you can, I can show you my Fendi, but that would be a thousand dollar bill all day. Um, 
I bought that one. I paid up for it for personal use. It's a 225, right? Sure can. Yes. Okay, making sure. Pop it in there. Yeah, here it is, Miss Pauline. It's beautiful. Too small for me. I tried. I put some stuff in there. But I couldn't I couldn't get it to to snap because I had it so full of my essentials. So I have uh neuropathy and some you know other medical issues. I gotta carry medications and stuff with me. I'd have to keep bigger bag. This one just was Karen was Oh, um, where is my phone case? Sit up there? No. Your phone case is on your TV stand. Your my phone case is? On the white TV. It's on your white table in there. Would, would you grab it, honey? They want to see if my phone fits in there. We're, we're going to grab my phone case. I'm actually on my phone. I have the Samsung Note 20. Yes, that'll fit in there. I know it will. We're going to put the case in there. It's a little bit bigger than my phone. That'll give you an idea. Do you want to see the... Will you want to grab the Patchwork Dooney while you're in there? It's hanging up. What's the Patchwork? It's the Dooney with the stripes. The big round one? Yeah, with the saddle, it's saddle leather and suede. It's not regular leather. Mine is... It's heavy bag. It is the saddle leather and suede. I know they do have similar ones. And oh, and the Kurt Geiger strap. Yeah, you guys, Hadrian just sent me this. <laughs> okay, so here's my phone case. You're welcome, Gary. <laughs> And it fits. So it sure does. Fits right in there. There it is. Um, the, the Fendi toe? No, no, ma'am. It's still in the bedroom. I was talking about the other Fendi. I forgot about that one. Dang, I lied. Didn't mean to. Yeah, I still have the Fendi tote. You're welcome, sweetheart. You want to see this, Karen? <laughs> it's a big old baby. It's a... What's the matter with that? Pause and box first track. Mm hmm. Hey, okay, the bag just wasn't that exact pause and box first track. Yeah. It was. Did I say Hadrian? No, I got this from Jamie. Yeah. I love this. I love it. Jeez, I don't even know who I got things from. My apologies. I got it from Jamie. That was way off on that one. Okay. So, Vanish did a comment. It's okay. I didn't mean to offend Lady B. She says. Hers is authentic and real, but she's not very nice. I'm afraid to buy the bag from her. Who is she? Okay, hold on. Oh, I want no. I wasn't offended anyway. But she's not very nice. I'm afraid about. What's she talking about? I'm not sure. She wants to come and see me. She says she misses me. <laughs> this one? <laughs> Count misses you? Yeah, this is my baby. No. What I meant was, is, I'm not, you know, hers could very well be authentic, too. You can, you can find, it's a rare bag, um, some of them are just the, the pebbled leather. Some are saddle leather. Um, some are made a little bit differently. Uh, 
I've not found another one. But this is. I, I really want to know what she meant by that comment. I don't know if it's about you or something else. No, not a reseller, I do believe. The chicken lady has one. Oh! She's your baby, but she wants me to adopt her. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. The other. <laughs> the J.W. Anderson. I bought this from Hadrian. It's cool, man. This is great for just running into the store or whatever. And it's a great statement piece. My phone fits right in there. Suede on the inside. <laughs> Great little statement piece to run into the store. <laughs> Love it. So we got the J.W. Anderson. I think I think the chain on the J.W. Anderson weighs more than the purse because the purse is really light. The chain's chain's pretty significant on this one. It is a. It's like a. Like a muted pink. It's pink. Oh, ah. Uh. The Jamie strap? Does that close in? Uh, yeah. Is that the Max Linux on this carry to think the JW? Huh? Don Hill said, is that the Max Linux on this carry to think the JW? Yes, that's the one. Well, that style. I'm sure it wasn't that exact. <laughs> I'm sure it wasn't that exact bag. Oh, look, Roiling. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I wouldn't even have thought of that. That's cute. <laughs> cute, cute, cute. Posing on there. There we go. I want a first try. <laughs> Didn't that look fire? You want a first try? I think she got this out of a uh, uh, one of those boxes. Oh, I haven't even got to use this one yet, man. That's cool. I want that strap. I really thought about that strap. Huh? I want it. The Zach it's a Zach Posen. It's real rabbit fur. Well, no. Um, the Zach Posen strap, hun, that's, that's a $50 note right there. That's real rabbit fur. Oh, the fun box. Yeah. She got it out of a fun box. Okay. That was a big rabbit. <laughs> That does look fire. It does. You're right, Jamie. That is cool. That is really, 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 really cool. Uh, find a little bag for that. Hmm? Hmm? 
think that's sold whenever you talk about mm -hmm. it. Yeah, the strap. Yeah. That means you want it. Mm-hmm. It's Fox fur. Oh, Fox fur? God dang, can I? It's my first day. It's fur. It's real fur. You know what, Jamie? I need to just be quiet because clearly it's my first day. <laughs> I need <laughs> need to go to school. What'd I say? Rabbit fur? Rabbit fur is softer. I should have. Yeah, when you that. first got it, you told me it was a rabbit fur. And I thought it was like weird. Cause it was I like, don't know. I was just excited. It was, like it was really cool. Stuck on strap. You guys want to see a really cool bag? Oh, I got to show you a cool bag. Oh, yeah, I've got a cool bag for you. Oh, stepping on pop things. Yeah, there's a uh, bubble wrap there. <laughs> I'm going to show Nan Hardy. That's in your room. Yeah, I'm getting it. Ed Hardy's my favorite bag so far. Linda's like, yes, all the bags. Oh, we'll be here we, a while to show all we'll the bags. We'll be here for a month. Yeah. Tote is in your office. Ask him if somebody wanted to see that fancy tote when I was up. I think somebody wanted to see that. earlier yeah i thought they were talking about my prize fendi up there i didn't know they were wanting to they were inquiring about the toad all right i got this from kristen d look at this bag love kills slowly <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Genuine leather and canvas. <laughs> Drew by Ed in Seattle. <laughs> Isn't this neat? Oh. Isn't it neat? Whoa. You guys remember Ed Hardy? <laughs> I mean, we got the tags here. This is genuine leather. It's got, yeah. Because I never really picked up Ed Hardy. For one, I didn't think anybody was interested in two. It, it's kind of one of those things like with um, Juicy Couture. I don't care for the faux leather with the this stuff on it because it, it peels and stuff. But we found she had a genuine leather one. <laughs> The back, but he wanted to go back to the pink first. Which one? The pink bag, please. Um, I have the Mark Jacobs and then the J.W. Anderson. Okay, yeah, I got that from Kirsten. Yes, it's copper. <laughs> I love how it says... Love kills slowly. <laughs> Got a beautiful strap. JW. Oh. I should put some stuffing in there for you. This is accordion style. It'll open up pretty good. It is the bull nose ring one. The you know. Yeah. It is. Yeah. 
There we go. I stuffed it all crooked, but it's there. Yeah. <laughs> it does open up quite significantly. Chunky hardware, very oh, significant. Much. The J.W. Anderson, she's 95. I got um, a really... Hadrian gave me a really, 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 really good deal on it. So I can pass off a good deal. These are expensive little things, man. And inside, it's online. It's got the suede inside. It's got... Just so you know, full disclosure, it's got a little spot. Spot's right there. But she is genuine. Beautiful. Statement piece, that one. Love it. She is gorgeous. And girl, you know, if you ever, if you're interested, I do do tradesies. Ask these girls. I ain't afraid to trade. I like to trade. Okay. And then I do have, I, somebody asked about the Fendi tote. I do have the Fendi tote. Perfect condition. Corners. Beautiful orange. Oh, my hearty. Uh, Jeremy's going, no. <laughs> I mean, I think it would. I, look at that. It is so cool. I love the fact that it's genuine leather. You know, it's got just a corner. So I would let her go for seventy-five. It's a big, big bag. Like, but, but I can't yeah, I threw out there. I don't want to sell a price, but I will if the price is right. So we are resellers. Check out the jewels. It's got all its jewels. <laughs> it is cool. Cool beans. <laughs> it was neat. I jumped on that one. <laughs> yeah, love kills slowly. Should take a picture of it. Send it to the ex. Or send to the ex. I can do it for you. Nah, he's been pretty cool lately. He's really been helping out with and, and helping with the um, getting stuff sorted with the plumbing and all that, you know. So I really, I really can't complain. I mean, I can. I'm a chick. That is really not fair. It's really not fair. He's been, he's been really decent. Not all chicks complain, okay? I do. No, you don't. You're <laughs> right, but you don't complain. <laughs> so she's pristine, guys. So whoever wanted to see the Fendi. And this one is still four fifty. if anybody's interested. $4.50? <laughs> It is cool. It is cool. It's really cool. I mean, some of them, you know, think I paid um, for shipping and all that pretty close to that. Um, so I wouldn't be making any money on it. It's really cool. But, you know, 
I just, I, I jumped on it, you know, because I don't want the faux stuff that's going to be all peely crappy and look like crap like a Juicy Couture does. One week in a Juicy Couture and it just peels. She's not got her Harley stuff yet. I have not, but he's, he, he did when he was over talking about the, um, plumbing stuff. He did ask me where it was. Because he said he hadn't come across it yet. I, I believe that is where it was. Mm -hmm. So, he's not going to hold on to it. So, I will get it, Angela, and then you'll have you'll be able to have at it. I got the, um, I liked my coats bigger. I had several coats. Some were embroidered. Some are vintage. I bought them when I was young. Um, they still have the body armor in it. Um, heavy coats. Um, I bought them in a 1X because I like them big because of the armor in it. Um, some blue jean jackets with the embroidery on the back. Um, some beautiful things. Oh, no. It's just big. No, the body is canvas. Just the leather and it. Um, the leather and all that. It's, it's genuine leather. So, this here. It's probably the heaviest things on the bag is the hardware. It's a nice fold over crossbody. It's cool. <laughs> That's a cool ass bag. That's a sleeper purse Fendi. Huh? That's a sleeper purse Fendi. The sleeper purse? That's what they're calling it, the sleeper purse Fendi. This is? Did you guys want to see my prized Fendi? I mean, this is a beautiful Fendi. But I have one put up. <laughs> you know, she showed that. Um, and, you know, when she was explaining what it was saying and then said, you know, love kills slowly. I was already hooked. She had my attention. And when she told me that all the trim and the details was genuine leather, that was it. I sent the email. Had to do it, man. It's my bag. <laughs> Princess Fendi. Good. So, I'm not tall enough to grab that bag. We'd have to get the six foot five guy to get it. Right now? Yeah. Okay. My prized Fendi. <clears throat> I'll show it to you. These Prada glasses are everything. Linda, you should see these. Look at these. Oh, no, I can't reach it. So bougie. Makes me feel bougie. Anything makes me feel bougie too, right? Hey. Like my sweater makes me feel bougie. This is a me. I've never seen this sweater. Uh -huh. My bougie sweater. I've never seen this. If they've ever seen this. Oh, I don't. I don't know if they saw that or not, honey. Yeah. This thing is bougie. <laughs> they have, I can't read what they're saying. Oh, I put my glass, my eyeballs on here. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> oh, it's <laughs> it is super duper fun. Super duper fun. Super duper fun. <laughs> so this is my prized Fendi, my baby. I think I got this one off the real real. I think I got this one. Is that the, the Fendi you got by accident? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's the one you got off the real real. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that a spy bag? But she's party. <laughs> yeah. I had to put my put a Karen charm on there. So but yeah, this one I love. Beautiful. It's not it you know, it sits kinda it's wider. It doesn't have a crossbody. But who cares? Beautiful. Beautiful.
Do you keep all? Now this, you know, she's not heavy. She's lightweight. She fits a good amount of stuff in there. This bag is everything. Everything. So. And the funny thing is, you know, if I ever got rid of this, I wouldn't sell it for no 350 bucks. I mean. I mean. I don't, I don't think so. I wouldn't charge that. Who, the Ed Hardy? I just got her. So I haven't carried her at all yet. She was just the wow factor thing. How often do I carry this one? Mm. I haven't as of late because I got a lot of Portland leather. <laughs> so I am as of this afternoon rocking this one Linda Portland leather oh this Fendi once the tote Fendi I used quite a bit but haven't reached for her in a while I get a lot of bags, so I gotta, you know, if they're cool, I gotta move into them. And then I gotta move out of them because more bags come. Ooh, something shiny. Ooh, yeah. something shiny. Three Ooh, something shiny. Later, <laughs> three days later, completely. Yeah, so I'm changing them out every three days. <sighs> I've only carried my prize Fendi once. And you know the queen? Guess how many times I've carried her? Guess how many times I've carried the king? I've never carried the king. You should have. It's true. You have some beautiful bags. Well, I was going to, and then um, when I had that altercation, I don't know if I got a little PTSD from that or not. Um, people getting, you know, smacked and, you know, getting robbed for their bags, not for the contents. Um, there's been some serious shady things going on, even in Charleston, Illinois, so... Some of the higher end ones, it, it, it just kind of depends. Jeremy's carrying Isabella Fiore weapon bag. The ultimate weapon bag will knock you out. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> My aunt Sarah tried taking it from me. <laughs> you have two persons? <laughs> So right now I'm carrying this one. But yeah, the, you know, I'm one of those. If they're ultimately prized, like the Christmas Dooney, I carried that for, what, the whole month for Christmas. And I haven't carried, carried it again. The other one, um, the other little satchel, excuse me, the little satchel, I haven't carried that at all. I haven't even taken the wrapping off of it. I know, that's what you're talking about. Yeah. So... When I'm swinging a giant bag of purses at another human being because they're coming at me because of what I have, um, Should have my bag where, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I think I scared the poor mailman. I come up behind him and I grabbed him by the back. <laughs> By his back. So I'm I like, you're going to help me, huh? Keep this in your car in case of those scenarios again. It is crazy what's happening. Um, but. I can keep this in your car. In case you yeah, I've, I've carried her once. Um, I would be devastated if something happened to this one. 
So, and the queen. There's a queen. My, you know, my all-time favorite. But she's very loud luxury. You, you would spot that. I would spot that a mile away. Well, I wasn't. Hi, Kristen. How was your sale? Hello. I couldn't get anything out of Kristen's sale because everything's sold. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> she said my friend got the Oriani. Which one of you guys got the Oriani? Probably Vicky. So, Kristen, we're going through some of my personal collection. We got the Fendi. And they're they're talking about my prized Fendi. You know, they're godsmacked. So, but with the, the Louis being such loud luxury, that's just drawing attention. When I had the canvas Louis, it drew a lot of attention. And... People would remark on that bag so much it made me uncomfortable. So. Yeah, people are afraid of me with my Isabel Fury over here. I don't yeah. Know why. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so. But. So one of my buckets, my one of my new buckets sold. So, but I did, like I said, with the straps, you guys, from Portland Leather Goods, I went ahead and ordered two more, and then I ordered two leather straps for us um, before they sell out, because I do have that sale going on, so I did grab some more. Yeah, you guys want to see the queen? In the Alexander McQueen bag, you know, I paid Hadrian several hundreds of dollars. I paid a lot of money for it. And, uh, yeah, with with all the attention with the LVs, uh, yeah, let me put this somewhere. I don't want to step on her. The queen. Queen, and then that's the princess. Huh? Why not? She's gorgeous. She's married. Doesn't mean she can't have a crush. Yeah. You're truly amazing. But look, don't touch. <laughs> 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 Let's see here. Okay. The queen. In all her glory. <laughs> you officially almost showed that in every video. I know. I could show the queen all day, every day. Carry her around the house. <laughs> she would like to come out to play. <laughs> She's got her pillows. She gets pillows. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. And 
she is pristine on the inside too. Your wife might have been oh, is the light going? Yeah, the light is going. The light is going. <laughs> is it on or is it barely on? It's on. Barely on. Barely on. But we didn't have time to really charge it up either before we used it. Okay, we got it for a good minute. It's all right. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, you hush, Jeremy, over there. Peanut gallery. So yeah, this is my most prized baby. I love the colors. Beautiful. Yeah. I hope to get to a thousand subscribers someday. But you know, it's taken me a year to get here. <laughs> and I'm alright with that. I'm okay with that. Baby. Cheese. Yeah. <laughs> Love her. If Ziggy gets a hold of that purse, I don't think he'll survive it. Do you ever come across a bow bow by Ziggy? As a matter of fact, um, fun fact, you guys are gonna shoot me for this. I did come across one. And I wasn't aware of just how popular they were. I thought it looked, I didn't want to know what I thought. <laughs> um, I wasn't a fan, let's put it that way. And I made the comment, what the heck is a bow bow? And I showed it to somebody else and then I hung it back up. And you know how much that purse was? $3.99. And I walked away because I didn't know what it was. <laughs> <sighs> Linda, I didn't know. It was in Podunk, Illinois. Goodwill. It was a little handbag. It was the metallic, like, silver iridescent. Opened it up and it said Bow Bow on the inside. And I was just like, what is this? And I messed with it. I showed it to somebody else. We had a chuckle and I hung it back up and walked away. I didn't know. Until Hadrian said something. Yeah. And then, yeah, I was kicking myself in the seat of my pants. I have... My Goodwill that I have here literally has one coat rack to hang purses on. That's it. If I want to source purses um, in person, most of mine are sourced um, online or I got to travel. So if I say I'm doing a day of sourcing, I'm gone all day. I will leave here early in the morning. I won't return until the evening. Now, I live in a college town. So, if you're wanting shoes, clothing, anything like that, I got the, the fun young little Richies, little Richie Rich teenagers and, and uh, people around here. Um, I got you, but purses, not so much. Wallets, I have a hard time with the littles, man. Are they awful? Hmm. They're pretty bad here. Um, but they know me quite well. I'm wondering, just so you guys can see what I'm up against, one of these days I will see if they'll let me record. I'm sure they will. Um, especially here in Charleston, they'll let me. But, you know, yeah.
and going up towards uh, like Chicago or something like that is not an option. Chicago is not a place I want to be right now. It's not not very safe. Some of the outer suburbs are fine, but I won't go inner city. Yeah, mine suck pretty bad. <laughs> I should record it let you guys see. All right, this is what I got. So I'm in a place where they think that um, there was two Vera Bradley handbags um, in the case for 49 bucks each. They think Vera Bradley is queen bee around here. Sometimes there are gems they don't know what they have. But, th yeah. So. Yeah. But, I mean, but, you know, it's good. I really like supporting other resellers uh, and what have you. Like I like doing the trading. Um, you know, I get a lot of great deals from Jamie and Kirsten and Vicky and Robin. So, night, Karen. Love you, girl. I've never been to the bins. There isn't one close to me. They have something in, in like Effingham, but that is a Amazon bins thing. It's not a Goodwill bin. Hi, girl. <laughs> Bye. So, so, we saw the queen. Anything else you guys want to see? Yeah. I mean, you can pull some great bags from there, but you're going to pay 10% over retail. Because they're going to charge you retail, and then they're going to charge you their handling fees. I, I did have Amazon broker a deal, an international deal for me. Um, it was for, you remember Dawn had the leap skin tote and then Vicky bought it from her. You can't get them stateside. Some of those, um, the gentlemen that I, I pull in the long champs from or that I pull in from Europe or from the Ukraine, um, we'll have Amazon broker that deal. Oh, the Amazon bins. Ah, uh, I've never, I've never bothered. Ah, uh, hmm. Depends what kind of shape they're in. I mean, that's good. A used Patricia Nash, fifty to sixty-five resale. Um, depending depending on the style and how big they are. So if you pick them up for a hundred, and if you're looking to personal use, go get them. If you're looking to resell them, not so much. Just it, it yeah, it, it's really kind of up to you. But if, if one of them is one of the giant leather Patricia Nash totes, um, I sold mine at one twenty five each. Um, but they were new with tax. It's it's amazing, but her resale value isn't. I have uh, Patricia Nash maps, satchel in there still, new tags. Um, the flat bag is no longer available. That is shipping out. That'll be picked up in the morning. Um, but I do have 
the Dooney um, Florentine, the brand new with tags, um, Red Smith is back on the market. I have a Stina resells bag. It's sold. I got the long chop. This I sourced from Stina resells. I like doing that. I, I think it's fun. And I like it, you know, when they, they get my bags and, and they show them, you know, I'm very proud. Ooh, look, that's my bag. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> I like that. I think it's very fun and it makes me proud. Yeah. You know, the market now is flooded. They must, you know, with TJ Maxx's year in sale. The mark is now flooded with a bunch of TJ Maxx bags. I think it's funny. And, oh, the New York. Mm. Yeah. That would be worth 50 bucks. Angela, I would get that one. What kind of satchels? I, I have a Patricia Nash. Um, you know what? I wonder. It did sell, didn't it? Um, I did buy a Dooney satchel. It's too small. Uh, Let me see. Did did the yellow um, Kate's or not Kate's baby Tory Burch satchel sell? Which one? The big one. The yellow one with the orange on it. Yeah. Yes, that's sold. That's sold. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, oh, Evangelist got it. I'm not going to show you that. So, Val, which kind of satchels? I got the Patricia Nash. Um, let's see. I have the new Dooney. I bought that brand new. Let's put it back here so I can look at her beautiful. <laughs> so satchel styles. I got some speedy styles. She's so sweet. You don't have anything specific. <laughs> Let's see. Satchel. I do have the Patricia Nash. That's a little... Um, I have... Yeah. The, the other satchel... I'll show you. It, it, it's, it's a smaller one. And I don't think it's going to work. This is a smaller one. 
haven't carried her yet. She's about half the size of my Christmas bag. She was here earlier, but then she fell asleep. Um, that was going to be my project for tomorrow, Angela. So I'm going to have a look and do that again. I decided I'm going to start going through that every month. Hmm? Yeah, this is that one that Dee Dee was talking about that it kind of changes color with like what you're wearing. It's actually oyster. But here it looks purpley. I had I had a blue shirt on earlier and it looked gray. <laughs> yeah, Vicky probably went to bed. <laughs> yeah, she's gorgeous. But my other one isn't that big or is bigger. Me and my satchels. This small satchel. This is the small, well, might be medium to them. Ooh. To me, it's small. I do have a black one coming, but of course, it's on delay. It's delayed shipping. So, here's... Here's the Christmas one. It is still hasn't even relaxed enough yet for this to <clears throat> slouch. See, it's quite a bit smaller. So I'm saying this is the medium because I think there's one smaller than this one. Oh yeah, Remember that? that's the Christmas dinny. So I figured if I'm going to drop that kind of money, it's going to be a big one. But when I got these, this bag was only $30 more than this bag. Which, not purple, brown, gorgeous colors. <laughs> Angela, so. Okay, Angela. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, so these tend to be, these can get quite hefty. This one does have some weight to it, too. So, if you like this style in the oyster, I'll let you guys know when they're having, like, another sale event on it. Um, get the mini. This isn't the mini. I think this one is the small. I don't Oyster. Girl, you don't want to know what I paid for this bag. <laughs> the Christmas bag? Let's just say I paid over $200 for the Christmas bag. So. I got... There, there was a sale. It was like... Just, oh, I know. <laughs> um, the sale. There was a sale on it, though. But I think it was like 15% or 20%. All it did was drop the tax and the shipping off of it. So, but yeah. So, it's like these run $349.99 or $369.99. I paid two hundred and twenty-five dollars for this shipped. So for this one, this one is a all-weather leather in purple. So you can take it out, rain, snow, shine, whatever doesn't matter. But that stuff tends to be a whole lot heavier. It is a heavy bag. Not gonna lie to you, man. <laughs> it's a heavy bag. It's not as heavy as the Smiths. 
Okay. We're pretty close. Yeah. Yeah, and it's not as anywhere near as heavy as the Isabella Fiore that Jeremy's carrying. <laughs> so. But you can get this, Linda, um, in the Oyster. In the Mini, which would be... Um, this is still a pretty good size bag for the small. I would get the mini so it's not so heavy. And it's probably a little more than half of this size. And you still get the look. You just don't get all the weight. And it'll still hold a ton. Just to let her know when he said it's a little purple. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So, let's grab those, but, yeah, so I'm thinking, may decorate this one up, and move into this one, because the Portland, that one, I thought it was bigger, I didn't read, I thought it was like one of the big crescent moons, but it's not, it's smaller, because mama can't read. Jam pack. You could if you actually stopped the read before you bought it. Yeah. If I come across one, um, in Oyster, I have a black one coming, but if I remember correctly, it, it may be that size. It may be the small size, but it's black. Um, if you like the Oyster, I will keep an eye out because I do, um, come across the Doonies. I just won't always pay what they want for them. But I do get, with when it comes to the Doonies, I do get approached uh, by sellers quite often. So if I can get one for a great deal, I will definitely let you know. Night, Duforte. Thanks for coming, sweetie. Sniff this bag. <sighs> the leather. It's amazing. Why? <laughs> because there's nothing like great leather. Just smell the great leather. Like. <sighs> you know, the lady, yeah. But I do have more Doonies coming. Another satchel in black. And I got a lot coming, I tell you what. You guys getting tired? Yeah, I'm it's saying, gotta be close to midnight now, isn't it? Uh, 1126, they're saying goodnight to Mm-hmm. So if there's anything else you guys like to see. Stop getting <laughs> Oh, that's what I forgot. The Portland Leather Round. Um, I couldn't find it. And then I went back and looked at my notes. The Portland Leather Round has sold. Yeah, it was the large round. But they are having a 25% off sale right now, Cindy. I think you can pick up that bag for uh, the large one for $99 right now. <gasps> Linda, you know how much that thing would be worth now? Good grief. Ooh. Good night. See you, Valerie. Yeah, they're having a they're having a really good sale. But I didn't I didn't pick up another round. I just got what I thought was the big crescent moon and some straps. I ordered some more straps and some coin purses. Tonight, I noticed a bunch of other resellers were selling them for 25 30 bucks or what have you. I was able to score them guys for $18 each. Some of them are 16 
So if there's anything else you guys don't want to see, it's the middle of the night. I am going to sign off. And my little light died. Dang. Mm -hmm. I have a yard sale on the Lady Promise coach. Ooh. Pick up some good ones. Maybe we can do some tradesies. Um. Even though mine was a large round, yeah, it you gotta be you gotta put smaller stuff in it. But you can get a good you can get a good amount in there. But uh, you know. Good night, Michael. Thanks for coming. Nice to see you. But okay, if everybody is done, I will sign off myself. Yeah. Get this all up. Make sure everybody's got all their stuff. You guys have a good night. You guys. <laughs> we will. Well, in a little bit. <laughs> but you guys have a great night. I have to take this light, light thing off because I can't even hit the... Oh, here we go. See? This is what I got. Oh, let me take this off. How do you turn it off? Or is it solar power? There's a button on the top. There's oh. a button on the top? There's a button? Oh, look. It does, it does things. Hold it. You gotta hold it. Put it off. I gotta hold it? So you, you're flashing on the camera, but it's like... <laughs> See, it's just one of Super. these things, and it fits on the top of your head. It's pretty cool. So there you go. So maybe I will see you guys for Hadrian's sale tomorrow night. And then I think it's my weekend. So I think Sunday, fun day, I think I'll see you Sunday. It's all right. So I will see everybody Sunday. And I will see you tomorrow night, too, for Hadrian's Live. Yeah, you guys, less than 20 bucks. And it fits right on top of your cell phone. And that's what I used tonight. We was able to see the purses. It was brand new. Jeremy just brought it in, so I didn't have time to charge it. But it lasted an hour and a half without a charge. So it's pretty cool. Bye, everybody. I will see you tomorrow night. Bye.